What do you know about Julio Julio? Let's start from there. I, I think he's a piece of shit. All right, so look, man. Two-part video here, but it's going to be a quick one. I got to get me some sleep, fam. But let's start with Julio. Now, one of the uh, alleged murderers, well, not even alleged, right? He did it. We see you on the video, dude. Leaving the Airbnb, doing all this and that. Look, not gonna lie, it's looking like you're a cook, buddy. But that's just my opinion. I'm not a professional in the legal field. I could be completely wrong. But anywho, it's this gutter Zay, dude. Gutter Zay. Ain't this the same one that had the real little bitty, 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 bitty 23 chain on? Let me go look up this dude. Yeah, that's him. That little 23 chain on. He wore a inksy binksy teeny weeny 23 chain when he went sliding on Folio in Jacksonville. You know what? My bad. It was Temple. Let me correct myself. This dude, the one that got Younger Nate's name tied into it. How you gonna go kill Folio wearing this 23 chain, man? Don't you know we could just go to your Instagram and see that little 23 chain? You got a little 23 chain. Young and Ace got a big 23 chain. So thanks to you, Young and Ace been a part of this investigation, dude. Soon as they seen you with that 23 chain on, everybody tied this to Young and Ace, even if it don't have anything to do with Young and Ace. I'm just saying you made it hot for him, dude. At least square away your Instagram and other social medias before you go killing people. I'm just saying. But yeah, they had him in the interrogation room. And they slipped up, man. Somehow this footage got leaked of the officers. They was clowning Fulio for being dead. That man said, Fulio, let's start from there. Uh, I think he was a piece of ish. You know what, let me just play the footage for y'all. What do you know about Julio Fully? Let's start from there. I think he's a piece of shit. I watched all those videos. <laughs> I went down that, that rabbit awesome. hole. Yeah, we all did. I've had jokers desecrating graves. He is asking to be killed. There is no doubt about it. It was inevitable. I can't believe it took this many years for somebody to kill him. Honest to God. Now, I don't know. Could this mess up the investigation of any sort? I'm asking y'all because I genuinely don't know. Like, could this gutter Zay dude use this against them since it's now public knowledge that they that they saying this about Fulio? Could Fulio mom uh, now ask, is this case being uh, handled in the correct way? Like, they supposed to be solving his case, not telling the person that murdered him. Hey, I thought he was a piece of ish. I'm surprised it took y'all that long to get him. Like, she possibly have a case on her hand or something now, right? I don't know. That just sounds a little crazy to me. Now, I definitely get it. They're just playing mind games with the suspect. But the problem is, now that this video is public and Fulio's family can see it, Fulio's mom can see it, legally, uh, maybe that possibly could change things. Who knows? I'm not a detective, dude. I'm a YouTuber. But nonetheless, I know these guys hate themselves right now. Yeah, Fulio's dead, but at what cost? What did you really accomplish? You didn't get a big bag or anything. You locked up, probably never getting out. The only thing that changed is Young and Ace is running up a bag right now. That dude out here living life. Life goes on, fam. Ain't nobody sitting around thinking about y'all. What y'all thought y'all was going to get locked up? The whole world was about to sit around and say, free you. Like, bro, when I say y'all crashed out, y'all crashed out, fam. Y'all took a field trip, dude. These dudes took a field trip to go and murder Fulio. Probably packed bags with lunches and everything. Drove all the way from Jacksonville to Temple just to crash out. Dude, what is this, the magic school bus? Y'all taking field trips now, dude? Seriously? Y'all doing all of that? Y'all think it was a million dollar hit or something? And if y'all don't calm down, wait till that dude get back to Jacksonville or something? 
out here shooting up hotel parking lot. Have some respect. And while I'm talking about Fulio, it's kind of off topic, but still on topic. Hey man, whoever run the Fulio Instagram page, y'all must be stopped. Still doing paid promotion from his page, that's one thing, right? Understandable. The dude wasn't that big of a music artist, and his family still got to eat, right? But telling up and coming artists to hit your DM for promo, that is nasty work. How you about to promote other artists from a deceased artist page? What you think this DJ Academics do? This ain't Say Cheese. This Fulio page, you can't promote other artists on this dude page. Now, if it's his artist, totally different. Or like his, his people, his close people, his like cousins or family, all of them six block people he always rapping about. See? That's different. But just random up and coming music artists for paid promotion. Really, bro? Y'all let me know y'all thoughts about that in the comments down below. But moving on to the second topic. Dude, I don't know what's going on. I was about to go watch the new Mo3 video, man. Came up too. It just dropped yesterday. The only problem is, it's gone. It seems to be taking out the entire YouTube platform after receiving like 75,000 views in one day. It, it just vanished, I don't know. Now one option says, this video isn't publicly available. For those of you who are not familiar with uh, YouTube, that could mean that they just basically put the video on private, right? But see, when I click the link, it says this video is no longer available due to a copyright claim by Jalen Jackson. I have no clue who that is. But yeah, long story short, I'm just as clueless as y'all. I guess we're going to have to sit around and wait to see what happens. But my guess is it's just what it says. It's private right now. They probably got a copyright claim somewhere, a copyright strike. Got to go in and clear it, and then they'll make it back public. Now, that's just me guessing. I have no information. But being a YouTuber myself, that's going to be my guess. They're going in to do some type of change to the video. But outside of that, that's pretty much all I got to talk about. But anyway, man, how y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comment section, bro. Like, comment, subscribe, that notification bell, man. Hey man, follow me on Instagram, TZF Baby 252. Long Lil Mo3. I'm gone. Lip it. Ay. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in the streets.